Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, at the beginning of last month, November, I posted letting you know that Microsoft had confirmed that Copilot was causing desktop icon issues when using more than one monitor. And just a quick recap, as I will leave that video down below, to prevent users from encountering this issue, they said that Copilot in Windows might not be available on devices that have been used or are currently being used in a multi-monitor configuration. Now, just to let you know that um, after posting that video now, on the 30th of November, which was yesterday in my region, Microsoft now has issued an official health dashboard known issues um, post on their health dashboard page where they have said that Windows devices using more than one monitor might experience issues with desktop icons moving unexpectedly between monitors or other icon alignment issues when attempting to use Copilot in Windows in preview. And this is applying to Copilot now on Windows 11 and also Windows 10. So Microsoft says to prevent users from encountering this issue, Copilot in Windows might not be available on devices that have been used or are currently being used in a multi-monitor configuration. And this is the reason why you might also not be able to update to Windows 11 version 23H2 from version 22H2 of Windows 11 or Windows 10 version 22H2 if you meet the hardware system requirements. So they have applied a compatibility hold on devices encountering this issue. So if you haven't received the 23H2 feature update to Windows 11 yet, this could be a reason why where Copilot is causing issues in a multi-monitor configuration if you have a multi-monitor setup um, for your system. Now, just take note that Microsoft says, and I do agree with this, they say they recommend that you do not attempt to manually update to Windows 11. So that would be using the um, media creation tool as an example. So if you just head over to that website, um, they recommend not using the media creation tool as an example or manually updating until this issue has been resolved. Um, the best way to get your 23H2 feature update would be through the Windows update process on your device. And they say they are working on a resolution and will provide an update in an up-and-coming release. Now, I have seen um, quite a couple of comments on the channel that a whole lot of viewers haven't been upgraded to version 23H2 yet. And uh, obviously, this could be a possible reason. So I'm just letting you guys know about it. And as mentioned, this issue is affecting Windows 11's version 23H2, 22H2, and Windows 10 version 22H2. And obviously, if anything and more info becomes available or this issue gets resolved with this Copilot multi-monitor issue preventing you from upgrading to Windows 11 23H2, I'll obviously let you guys know. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.